Well, in my last few videos, I discussed about what is wounded feminine energy, how does it look like, and how I was also operating from my wounded energies for almost maximum parts of my life. If you haven't already watched those videos, I would highly request you to go back and watch those videos because they will give you context what I am speaking here, and then you'll be able to better relate and you'll be better better able to start your journey. Identify if you also have some of those symptoms of wounded energies, and if yes, then there is no shame in it. I was also there, and many of us in today's world are there. But recognizing it and healing from it is your responsibility. Do not blame other people that because of them you have become like this. No, have an accountable and winning mindset. Take the responsibility. Take charge of your life because you can do it. and start working on yourself and i am here to help you become the most authentic truest and highest version of yourself to live this life in its fullest terms because that is what our purpose is our purpose is to show up and become better and better version of ourselves and then to help others become better version of themselves so sit back and be ready for the most simple and powerful steps to begin your inner work journey number 1 start your journey of becoming self aware because everything starts from knowing yourself and as i talked in my last video also you cannot heal your pain until you know that there is a wound causing the pain until you know that there is a problem how will you heal it so you have to know what is the problem you have to dive deep within yourself to find out what is that triggers you what is that makes you unsafe what is that makes you unsecure why you are jealous why you are fearful why you have become dull dim what is your limiting beliefs and for all of that you can go and watch my series becoming unstoppable because that series is all about developing self awareness in very simple steps so seriously take that step for yourself because you only can step up for yourself and you only can change your life so go back and watch that series and start practicing self awareness start knowing yourself more so that after knowing only you can know that what parts of it needs to number 2 self care yes self care or self love might sound very cliche or might sound very overused but this is something very essential start taking care of yourself holistically not just taking care of your body but taking care of your mind start consuming healthy and nutritious from all your senses and that is what i have spoken in my other series called decoding sustainable wellness secrets so all my series are very thought upon and very visionary because i have done that in my inner work journey and that is why i made those series to help you guys start and begin your inner work journey so go back and watch that second series as well start inculcating the practices of holistic wellness because it all starts from healthy body healthy mind when you are nurturing and nourishing your mind and body then only you can think higher then only you can think better then only you can live your truest potential so that is essential treat your body as your temple treat your mind as your gift and nurture it number 3 start embracing and practicing your dark feminine energy if you don't know what dark feminine energy is and how you can embrace it go back to one of my videos just recent videos where i have dived deep in dark feminine energy and how you can practice it just go back and watch that video and start inculcating those practices because a dark feminine energy women is actually the one who is in her true potential and power she practices self esteem and self worth she knows her value and she knows how to conduct herself she knows how to say no she knows how to not people please she knows how to speak up for herself she lives in her highest self she lives in her passion she lives in her highest beauty beauty doesn't mean the outside beauty beauty means the beauty of inside beauty means being empathetic being considerate and number 4 become visionary envision yourself as the highest version of yourself and start taking decisions from that standpoint and how will you envision yourself from that standpoint until and unless you are self aware that is why number 1 step is very important becoming self aware when you become self aware you will come to know that what is your dream version what you actually want to become in terms of your family in terms of your career in terms of your love life and then you will be able to 
become visionary and take decisions from the highest version of yourself for example you go to some grocery store and you have got lot of option you will only choose the option that nurture your body you will not choose trash food you will try to avoid all the kind of processed and junk food that doesn't mean you have to overstress yourself with only consuming nutritious and healthy food no i recommend balance i always do that i mostly consume clean healthy food but at times i treat my body and i treat my cravings as well so you can maintain a healthy balance but most of the times choose clean wholesome plant based nurturing nourishing food and not the processed junk food because that is not going to electrify your body that is not going to give you your highest energy to thrive so start taking decision from the highest dream version of yourself ditch the instant gratification and start practicing delayed gratification from your long term vision and in this endeavor if it all it crosses your mind that you are being selfish no by all means you are actually big you are actually being the most selfless version of you because when you work on yourself and become empowered you actually empower others around you in a better authentic way you actually serve others in a more grounded way you serve others more genuinely more whole heartedly you will be able to show up more stronger version of yourself and you will be able to strengthen others as well and the relations you'll start building will feel more fulfilling more grounded more connected more deep as opposed to the superficial relationships you used to have when you were operating from that mask so these are four very powerful practices which you can start doing and start your inner work journey that's all from my side for today very soon our next video is going to come up till then stay tuned like this video share it if you find it valuable and share it with people whom you think it might be relatable to who need this kind of stuff and subscribe my channel till then bye take care of yourself my name is batul and thank you so much for watching